brother Jude. This little man helped me unload. Be back to where it needs to be. Motivation. Take my brother out the hood. Rocking out with me, help me out. I'm back home, baby. Almost officially. Almost officially back. Almost officially back. First day back in California. First day back. First day back in Cali. How about that? How are you guys doing? This is how I look my first day back. You know, we writing some books over here. Solar gazing. <laughs> look at that. We're going to throw a little, little I'm back in Cali energy. We're going to throw a I'm back in Cali party. And then when we done throwing the I'm back in Cali party, we're going to throw the birthday party. I'm too smart to be broke. Yeah, you, you go down there on the trail and all that. You could take your walk down there. You, you can walk right down there. Come on, man. The ancestors be in the mountains getting the revelations, coming back down and tell everybody, y'all spoke directly with the supreme being. That's what they do. Solar gaze, man. Don't let them tell you something's wrong with looking at the sun. It depends on what hours you're looking at. Let's solar gaze tomorrow live. Let's do that. The solar gaze. I'm going to have my hair cut. I'm going to the uh, the face masseuse. The face gem. Yo, come on. I'm back home. Back in LA. Can't wait. And I got my homie with me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they should have never let us make any money. <laughs> Thanks, brother. That's my man, son. We could get in everything, baby. Right? I could get the family from the airport. And I brought my, my mother-in-law. Oh, y'all want to... Let me show you how the gangsters do. Let me show you. Show you how the gangsters do. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Let me show you how the gangsters do. Lovely kitchen. But let me show you how, the, how we do it. You go in the room. And you got a pool table. Second you wake up. You at it. That's behind door number one. Yeah, this is dope though. Yeah, we all over. So much stuff to move. So much. <laughs> Which bathroom? I said I'm shaking the bathroom. We sharing the room. What you mean? Yeah, you you joining us, little man. You guys are here on very special invite. You guys are MVPs, helping me put everything together. You guys are helping me put everything together. So, boom, wow, look at this amazing thing. This is amazing. I think this is all amazing. What do you think, dude? This is amazing? Okay, just making sure. I told my brother, come, come F with me. Yeah, I know. You don't believe, man. My, my, my brother got all that stuff. You hauled it out. 37 hours. Damn. I was living in Miami and shit. Little girly energy. I was living in Miami. Yeah. Like. Get my wife's, my wife's mother. Yeah, you wake up, get some breakfast in bed, and boom. Imagine waking up and you just, you put it down like this. <sighs> it's not bad, not bad, not bad. Not bad, if I do say so myself, not bad. Come on, man. You know we you know we doing some music in here. Don't play around now. Can't show you the whole crib. <laughs> nah. Yeah, I need that right there. The music studio. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to figure it out. Right 
I know, I know your hood antics. Nigga came and swim, and he talking about jumping off into the pool. So what's up, Jube? You motiv you motivated? You already know. Hey, yo, listen. You live? Yeah, I'm live. Yo, I'm telling everybody out there, if you don't want this in your life, we don't want you in our life. <laughs> I love the slogan. Like that, come on, man. Don't care where you come from. You come from a rich family in the suburbs. If you don't want this in your life, and then jump off the helicopter, man. <laughs> man, if they got access to the helicopter, you might want to reconsider keeping your life. <laughs> <laughs> We are not in the middle of the mountain, people. We at the top. We at the top on our end. Yeah, we up here. Yo, the air is different. You ain't gotta worry about nobody smoking no damn cigarettes. You know what I'm saying? Not smoke here, you die. Listen, what y'all gotta see though is in the nighttime, you feel like you could touch the sky. And it's just so quiet. And then when you do the trail, you just take in all that good bacteria, man. Bring the babies down and let them walk through the dirt. Oh. It's just fun, man. I'm glad my man brought his little man. What's up, King? Now you want to be WB Frog. Nothing. Nothing. We're going to keep it on you. Wait. <laughs> he he out of here. <laughs> yeah, you had a long trip too, right? Just having fun. Just having fun. Lit. Definitely, lit. Definitely lit. This is just the first day back, though. This is... Plenty more going on. This is just day one. Man, I miss LA. Gracias de Madres. <laughs> Vegan Mexican restaurant. What's up? Talk to me. Talk to me. This COVID is really blowing my high, man. I was trying to, I was not trying. I was falling back until things could get right, but it seemed like it ain't never going to get right. But you know, the birthday turn up going to be. Hmm. Birthday turn up is gonna be mean. See, it ain't all about the bread, but the bread puts you in position so you can be in your space mentally. I don't wanna to have to drive somewhere just to get that energy. I could just wake up and get that energy right where I'm at. Woo! I don't, yo, my thing is invite people to the crib. Don't go out in the world. Create a peaceful sanctuary where you could just stay where you at. Man, there you go. Go to brotherpolite.com. Please make your, your money. Make your money, people. <clears throat> make your money. Make your money. And and create opportunities viable enough for you to fortify your spirit. That's all. Make your money, people. <laughs> make your money. Make your money. Make your money. Make your money. Brotherpolite.com. Let me write it. Man, I miss LA. Great first day back. Shit, so much stuff. Yo. You know we got to have the pyramids. Posh Tashilasado. Nukta Orfu Men Antu Tin Ya you know sad. Anuki Temli Pata. Anuki Pali U. Nuk about to Pali U Lat. Nuk about to Pali U Lat. Ama Bikun. A nuki pa mo hoi shil nes deru, pa re shil nes deru, pa musta ra shil shil nes deru. A nuki fi pa na wo shil re, pa na wo shil re da kun, ha yu i, da kun i, ha yu si na suf. The prayer of Osiris, people. The prayer of Usir, Asar. The prayer of Osiris. Come on, get our sage. Put these energies where they need to be. We have such a high altitude, it's easier to connect. There's less distraction, there's no frequencies in the way. Let's have a conversation about communicating with the heavens and his host via phase conjugation and coherent heart frequency. 
Let's talk about the unwinding of the DNA. Let's talk about the retrogradation of the DNA. Turn it into a phase conjugating mirror. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about money all over the goddamn place. What's in here? Not nearly enough. Not nearly enough. Wait a Let's talk about it. Oh, okay. Uh, we'll figure out the space. What time is it, Jube? I know we gotta. We gotta um. We gotta we gotta go to the airport. <laughs> Definitely need you for that, bro. <laughs> I need you to drive. Oh man, more money. Oh my goodness. Hold on. Hold on, man. Yeah, yeah, hit hit that shower, brother. Hold, hold on, family. You take the. You could take uh. Oh. <coughs> uh, the the child room the. The. The room that's more designed for the children. No. Go upstairs to the left. The room that. I want the room. The TV. I know what you want. I know what you want. Come on, get your stuff here. I don't want them. Yo, when it, yo, why you gave up this one? Yeah. Yeah, just, just go up, go up, and go to the room to the left. Up, up and to the left. Yeah. So my man Jude, he used to come to my lectures. Him and his team used to come, always buy like 12, 15 of my books. I used to be like, yo, who are these hood cats that's constantly buying like 15 damn books? <clears throat> they bang Hoover. I'm like, okay. Hoover's just reading and studying, okay. Yeah, so this looks more like, you know, I travel. Man. You know I gotta travel with the bread. You know, I travel with the money, like, hold on. We gotta get some light up in here, hold on. <clears throat> you know, you know, this ain't enough. Cause they said, the bills are too big. The bills are too big, right? Watch this. No, there's one, there's paper in between those bills. Hold on. This is not nearly enough for either people. Hold on, hold on. That's what we're now about to do. We're not about to act like <coughs> that's enough. What we're now about to do. So, just to show you, we don't, we don't play no games. Where you want to do this at? You want to do it over here? You want to do it over here? So yeah, yeah, I think this is a front. I think this is a front. Y'all think this is a front? Let me just make sure. Worrying about if the crib is rented? Okay, let me just make sure. This crib is hold on, hold on, hold on, God damn it. Hold on. Okay, this. Okay, we just make sure. Hold on, God damn it. You know, I just do this because I like to know. Increments of clean cheese. Hold on, hold on, hold on, God damn it. Let's see. It's 10. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100,000, 110,000. What the? Don't worry, little man. Your day is coming too, my brother. Don't worry. I'm helping your pops get this bread. And you got to put you in training. You got to be with my daughter and learn how to play with them stocks. You heard? You're 22-year-old, Nope. My 13-year-old. That's right. She play with those stocks. She she make her own allowance. You don't need to be asking your, your pops for no bread. So tomorrow, you sit next to my daughter. And when she's doing the stocks, you sit down and you learn from someone 
nearer to your age group, right? Because you want to make this, right? You want to make this, right? Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. Okay. So that's what you got to do. We're going to do this thing positive. You know, we're not going to make no music talking disrespectful to our own people and disrespecting our women. Because I, lis I listened to some of that music you was listening to the other day. It's enticing. The beats sound nice, but they talking something wicked. So we're going to do with our time. We're not going to listen to that because that stuff don't make us no money. In fact, it costs us money to be ignorant. You feel me? Yeah, so we're going to do something more powerful. You heard? <clears throat> yeah. So you too can count up to, where we at? We at what? One, 130 grand or 120? Where we at over there? Lose count. But um, one of these pulley cases, I told my wife, I told my wife to pack up the money. I got a, a Louis Vuitton suitcase. It's a small one packed up in one of these cases. You know, I like it when it when I open it up, it looked like something from out of gangster movie. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I got a good 150 grand in there too. So I got I well over a quarter million. Well over a quarter million. Well over a quarter million. I meditate into this. When they say, yo, what's the cheat code? How you got this money? Polite. Son, if I told y'all how I really get this bread, you know, yo, he must have stole it. I swear to you. Ain't no nigga stealing. Over a quarter million dollars in cash, and you know my account lit. I showed y'all the twelve, the twelve men, the twelve M's before, and I told you I don't have to touch it. I can show you again. Twelve M's in my account. One of them, I don't gotta touch it. If everybody's making all that money off of me, from what I teach on stocks, if they're making all that money from my text, I got the type of money that when I'm correct, I always make six figures. I got the type of money to be correct and make six figures. Because y'all are out there making five figures and four figures from stuff that I send you in a text. So what you think I'm making? <laughs> what you think I'm making? Like, come on. And the thing is, people, yo, don't show money because people will try to take it. But that's stupid because I teach my people how to make it. I teach you how to make it. Come on now. But I'm going back into my Lambo po phase. I might go live with y'all tomorrow so you can see me. Um, you Wi-Fi? Wi-Fi? Yeah. I'll, I'll tell him give me a few. <clears throat> I give it to him. Yo, let me know. Let me know. We gotta be out in like ten minutes to go to the airport. Yo, Jude. Tell Pops we gotta be out to pick up the family. I need him to drive. Yeah, hello. Stock classes, brotherpolite.com. I thought I and then do the real estate class. Because when you make that money off them stocks, you need to turn around and be right over here doing that. Fuck that, man. This shit is all. This shit ain't about showing off. I don't worry about someone taking bread and all that. I'm the money man. Like, I help my people make money. Motherfucker put a gun to me and asked me for some money. I like, yo, my only wish, if I got my last words to say to you, if you just sit down and let me talk to you for five, ten minutes, I change your fucking life. You don't even have to worry about it. I won't tell on you for putting the gun on me. And this may sound crazy, but I've done something like that before. My wife could tell you. I mean, that could tell you. I was at a restaurant, and they tried to get me, and I was going to the bathroom. And I coached those brothers out of that stupid experience. And I'm cool with them to this very day. They some of my goons that do security for me now. Facts. I taught them how to make bread. I changed their life. I spoke their ass out of that dumb shit. Like, why would you kill me? You got to protect me. I'm the, I'm the one making everyone in the hood money. You got to protect me. So when I walk these streets and I walk around the world, I don't give a damn if you had a problem with me or an issue. Yo, let me talk to you. I can help you make more money than you could complain about. And I do this every day because right now I'm on two months, three weeks, and I, uh, we're probably on two days now of nonstop receipts, <clears throat> nonstop confirmations. Yeah, so, come on now. That's why I walk around. I know I'm one of the most powerful beings on the planet. Because I don't just make my money. I teach my people how to make it. Shit, we got paper stacks all over the crib. And several cribs. I own my pop crib. I got paper stacks. And, I, and mind you, my pop crib is a crib I bought for my father. My father's living in the house that I bought him. Got money hidden there. He don't even know what's hidden in there. 
And I'm money hitting every crib. Every crib. Good luck to you. Man, you got to dig in this yard and find some of the money I got. <laughs> Word up. I'm just one of those people. I'm still from Brooklyn, man. You know, we got to keep a stash. White man run down on us about some bullshit. Okay, when I come back home in 10, 15 years, <laughs> coming out like the OGs do, still shiny. Because, you know, your own people always want to set you up, pull you down. You know, but I don't walk around in fear of people's ignorance. I walk around on the level, man. I hope you guys come out. I got a private birthday event. Just celebrating success, celebrating the fact that this has been an amazing year, truly, where so many of us have made money. If you're not making money with us, you need to get on board. Brotherpolite.com. Just get on board. Brotherpolite.com. I'm just happy to be back home. This is my first day back in Cali. It's been some months. I've been going to New York, been everywhere. I would have normally been all over the world, but this COVID was throwing it off. But this will do. And like I said, I'm bringing my wife's mom out. I gave her a job. She's eating tremendously. She lost her job because of the COVID-19 stuff. I told my wife, you don't got to stress about that. I sat down and talked to her mom. said, yo, you can run my publishing company and get a few other things going on. Boo -doo -doo -doo. Hooked it up. Give myself the smallest percentage. My wife and, mom and her mom's handled the larger percentage. <clears throat> I ain't tripping. I get all that shit back in stocks and real estate. So it's just, it's just all just extra money. Just give me a percentage of everything I help create for everybody. I want the smaller percentage. I got over nine streams of income. I always tell people get at least nine streams of income. You get nine streams of income, you don't worry about getting a larger piece of everything. I'm already getting pieces of nine different things. So I don't trip about bread. There's enough room and space for everybody to eat. So I told my, my homie, bring your son out. So if you bring your son out, his son could be empowered by the imagery. And then he could see how we make the money. He learned how to make it because he's a young man and he see my daughter is older than him. His ego as a young man, he's going to want to outdo my daughter. And that's what we want. And my daughter's ego, she's just always looking to do the adults. <laughs> so we take advantage of that. We take advantage of that. And we get it in. But we have fun, man. We have fun. But yeah, I do the real estate thing. People want to talk about renting out cribs. <laughs> I'm the king of renting them out. <laughs> I know. What y'all think? Y'all think there's no real money in here? Come on now. I just like to sell them because I don't ever want to really touch it. And and I, my gold my gold stash look like this too. My silver stash look like this too. But I got it in a refinery account. This is just in case I want to fuck off some money and just be on some other shit. But what we was not going to do is make you think it ended right here. I don't even know where this is from. I don't even know why we dealing with these small faces. Oh, but this was an atrocity. Look at this. Hold on. I got something right on me. I got some stuff on me. Some stuff on me. <clears throat> There you go. There you go. Get in that get in that mood. Get in that moment. Brotherpolite.com. Golden the Crisis. That's the stock class. See you this Sunday, 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time. I'll also see you for the real estate class. Peace to the fan.